Momo said he's a cranky old man. <laughs> In Espanol. <laughs> Guap. Guap. It's B here from Life on the B list. If you've been here before, welcome, welcome back. And if this is your first time, welcome. Thank you guys for watching and tuning in. I do travel and food videos, but today we're actually gonna head out and check out some birria tacos. I wasn't sure if I was gonna title this video annoying my husband for 24 hours or speaking only Spanish for 24 hours. So since I'm always annoying my husband anyway, I'm gonna name this the Spanish only challenge for 24 hours, but not really. Disclaimer, I'm not fluent in Spanish. I am not even fluent in English, so let's not even go there. Um, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try my best to speak in Spanish. I am allowed to use Spanglish, which is half Spanish, half English, but only in emergencies. Okay, so from now on, I'm just gonna be speaking in Spanish in five, four, tres, dos, uno, vamos! Gira a la izquierda hacia Devot Street, luego gira a la izquierda hacia Hathorn Street. Okay, vamos! <laughs> Chola out. Do you reckon we're gonna go eat tacos and I don't dress like this? I'm just kidding guys. I only put this on while we're inside the car. I mean, I'm not that rude. It's like if you go to Vietnam and you start putting on those crap hats. Um. <laughs> Soy Bernie. Um, ahorita vamos a comer algo en. Stop, stop, stop. stop. Ok, take two. Buenos uh, chicos, estamos aquí de nuevo. Soy Bernie de Life on the Bee List. Um, antes de eso, mi, espos mi esposo no quiere que yo uh, diga vamos. Entonces. Vamos a comer algo y ahorita vamos a Cabra Mata y vamos a ver todos, no, todas cosas Dentro de 500 metros, a Cabra Mata. ¿Es eso ok? Ok, vamos. Un comercial. So I just wanted to say if I can't say anything in Spanish but I say it in a um, kind of like a Mexican American accent that's okay too okay. Estamos buscando un parqueo ahorita y mi esposo está un poco de enojado porque porque mi wait hold on let me turn off this map Y por qué no me habla, amor? <laughs> okay, back to the Spanish lessons. ¿Saben que es chistoso? Um, haciendo un reto de hablar solo en español aquí y estamos en Cabramata. Bueno, eso es un poco de strange porque estamos en la ciudad de asiáticos. Un comercial. Ok, so it's going to be a little bit too hard, but 
we went to Fairfield to try and get those birria de res tacos but they ran out of the birria sauce or the birria soup so while we're waiting we just ended up deciding to come and get pho and um, I'm just hoping that I don't get full because I'm really looking forward to those birrias um, okay so have a look at my pho it's pretty good huh Terminamos el almuerzo y seguimos nuestra lección de español. Y yo no sabía que difícil, no, yo no sabía. How does it go? Que difícil era más. Sí, yo no, yo no sabía que difícil era de hablar español. Pero yo no sabía que difícil era de Mira, español es difícil, ok? Para mí, especialmente para mí. Y entonces um, vamos a vamos 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 a continuar nuestra lección. ¿Y cómo se dice cow en español? ¿Cómo se dice horse en español? Caballo. ¿Cómo se dice gate en español? Portón. 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 ¿Cómo se dice cranky old man? Okay, so regresamos a Las Birias y en camino, estamos en camino a Fairfield. Um, so, how do I say, ¿cómo se dice first? Primero. Primero, mm -hmm. vamos a tomar un, un beer, un, una cerveza. Después de eso, vamos a comer las birias de res. Okay, amigos, time check is 7.41 p.m. I've finished my Spanish only challenge, mini challenge, mini skill challenge. We've just finished eating dinner at Chololo and I'm now very, very sleepy and very, very happy. Out of five stars, Bob, how many? Four. Only four, how rude. I would say it's a solid four and a quarter out of five wow <laughs> i'm a little bit more generous than hubs over here he has given four out of five stars for i guess what is it that didn't give you the five out of five spicy it was too spicy yeah i have never heard of anybody complaining about anything being too spicy let alone any mexican food being too spicy um, I actually think their owners are Chinese, maybe Vietnamese Chinese, but who cares? I mean, the, the flavor was there, the, the heat, the spice was there. So that's it. That was our day today. I hope you enjoyed my little Spanish challenge. And um, 
our accidental fur mukbang that we didn't mean to have and of course our tacos oh the other thing is I couldn't really do a full you know full mukbang of the tacos it was too loud and it was too crowded and um, I felt really bad you know having to do like a, a mukbang and a review and there's like a whole line of people waiting out the door so if you like this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and of course hit that subscribe button share it if you like and I'll see you in the next video okay bye